They say when you look up at the night sky, you're not just seeing stars, you're peering back in time. The greatest mysteries of our universe are hidden in the vastness above. And now, humanity has built a tool capable of pulling back the cosmic curtain. NASA's James Webb Space Telescope is our window into the ancient past, a marvel of engineering that's begun to uncover secrets no one thought we'd see in our lifetime. But what it's recently found might just rewrite everything. Out in the vast dark expanse of space, the James Webb Space Telescope has been hard at work peering into the unknown, trying to find answers about our universe. This new tool from NASA has been sending back some jaw-dropping images of stars, galaxies, and planets. But recently, it stumbled upon something unexpected. Something so massive, it's got scientists rethinking what they know about the universe, and even questioning whether it could lead to major changes in our understanding of everything we hold true. When we talk about exploring the universe, we typically start with what we call the observable universe. It's like having a giant window that lets us look into the immense space that surrounds us. This part includes everything we can currently see and study with our telescopes and space probes, think stars, galaxies, and various celestial bodies. But it's worth mentioning that this tiny visible part is just a minuscule portion of the entire universe. Imagine it as a small slice of a gargantuan pie that's way bigger than we can even comprehend. Researchers figure that the observable universe stretches about 93 billion light years across, which is mind-boggling. A light year is how far light travels in a year, around 5.88 trillion miles, which is hard to wrap your head around. So, roughly 13.8 billion years ago, the universe kicked off with the Big Bang, a massive explosion that set everything in motion. Since that explosive beginning, the universe hasn't just expanded. It's been speeding up, pushed along by forces we don't fully understand, like dark energy. As this expansion goes on, matter starts to group together thanks to gravity. This process leads to the birth of stars, galaxies, and planets, including our very own Earth. Picture this. As the universe continues to expand, it's also incredibly sparse. If we shrunk our entire solar system down to the size of a quarter, the nearest star would still be about the distance of two soccer fields away. And this sense of emptiness isn't just limited to our solar system. It speaks volumes about the sheer size of the Milky Way galaxy, which is just one of billions of galaxies in the observable universe. You might be wondering why we can't just see everything in space. Well, there are a few reasons. The first is light itself. Even though light zooms across the universe at lightning speed, it still takes time to travel from distant objects to us. So, when we look at faraway galaxies, we're basically looking back in time. For example, if a galaxy is a billion light years away, we're seeing it as it was a billion years ago. It's like peering into a vast time machine that shows us the history of the cosmos. As the universe expands, galaxies, much like dots on a balloon, are also drifting apart. This motion causes a phenomenon called redshift, where the wavelengths of light stretch as they move away from us, often making those distant galaxies appear reddish. Because of these reasons, how long light takes to travel and the continual expansion of space, it's hardly surprising that we haven't managed to see everything out there, even with our advanced equipment. The quest to understand the boundaries of the universe has intrigued scientists and dreamers alike, leading to several competing ideas. The first thought suggests that the universe goes on forever, stretching infinitely in all directions. This aligns with a principle known as the cosmological principle, which implies that no matter where you are in the universe, it should look the same everywhere. Another theory proposes that the universe is finite but doesn't have a clear edge. It's more like the surface of a giant sphere. In that case, if you traveled endlessly in one direction, you'd end up back where you started, much like walking around the Earth. A third intriguing idea, known as the multiverse theory, brings in the concept that our universe is just one of potentially countless others, each with its own set of rules and conditions. It's a wild and fascinating thought that there might be universes completely separate from each other, or some that might even connect in strange ways. As for the James Webb Space Telescope, it's like our new magical wand, shining a light on the secrets of the universe. It's built to observe the cosmos with incredible precision, allowing us to catch glimpses from way back in time. Recently, a groundbreaking finding was published that pointed to the discovery of six massive galaxies dating back to just 500 to 700 million years after the Big Bang. 
These galaxies are way larger than anyone expected for their age, challenging the traditional ideas on how galaxies form and evolve. What's really cool is that these ancient galaxies display a level of complexity similar to our own Milky Way, despite being billions of years older. This adds a whole new layer to what we thought we knew, suggesting there might be a lot more stars packed into these galaxies than we first imagined. For one of these galaxies, researchers estimate it might even have a mass up to 100 billion times that of our Sun, making our Milky Way seem small in comparison. The JWST uses infrared light to uncover these ancient wonders, allowing it to spot faint emissions from stars and galaxies that have been around for billions of years. Really, it acts like a time capsule, shifting our view back to about 13.5 billion years ago and letting us peek at the universe as it was then. These amazing findings, affectionately called universe breakers, are turning our previous notions upside down. Initially, we thought galaxies took their time growing from small groups of stars, but these discoveries suggest they popped into existence much quicker and are way bigger than we believed. Scientists are now using various techniques to analyze this light, almost like detectives hunting for clues about the structure and distance of these overwhelming galaxies. It's a fascinating exploration, using light to piece together the stories of these massive entities. The discoveries from the James Webb Space Telescope have truly taken our understanding to new heights. Operated by an international team of experts, it has recently revealed some of the oldest and farthest galaxies ever observed. These findings take us back to a time when the universe was just about 400 million years old, showcasing how much more there is to learn about our cosmos. The web is doing some serious heavy lifting in uncovering the early stages of universe development and challenging our assumptions about galaxy formation and black holes. As we gather more information through its studies, our perception of the universe expands, alongside the very cosmos itself, reminding us just how much we have yet to uncover. The universe is watching us back. In every image James Webb sends home, we see more than ancient starlight. We see a reflection of our deepest questions. Where did we come from? How did it all begin? And are we truly alone in this vastness? The answers may not come easy, but thanks to this extraordinary telescope, we're closer than ever to finding them. And maybe, just maybe, as we peer into the universe, it's peering right back at us.